Maybe. Well, thanks for finding my hat. You're welcome, Clem. Do you want to pet the cow with me? Nah, but you go on ahead. Ähm, mal gucken. Was haben wir denn hier so noch? Nix mehr sonst, denke ich mal. Einfach mal alle durchgucken. Okay, ist auch so ein komischer Leckstein. Naja. Ich will Batterien für die Kamera. Ich will wissen, was da ist. You found it too, huh? Lee, they're hiding something behind this door. I got a quick look. They got boxes of stuff and something metal and sharp. Don't get paranoid. It's my job to be paranoid, Lee. I got my whole family on this farm right now. How about you? What about Clem? <clears throat> I'll protect her no matter what. I know you will. Look, that guy with Katya, what's his name? He locked it up real tight the second we came in. I definitely heard a noise back there, Lee. What? My point is we gotta know for sure. So go find a hammer or something and I'll have this thing off in a second. You back me up in case them farmers come running. Hang on, man. Think this through. You smash the lock. Then what if it turns out you're wrong? You just fucked your chance to get a good meal in those kids you're trying to protect. Use your head, Kenny. All right, Professor. What'd you have in mind? Let me have a look at what we're dealing with first. Hmm. Hey, Lee. You know how to pick a lock, right? No. Why would you say that? Well, you're... You know... Urban? Oh, you are not saying <laughs> what I think you're saying. Jesus, man, I'm from Florida. Crazy shit just comes out of my mouth sometimes. Sorry. Hmm. What? See those screws? Instead of breaking the padlock, we can just take off the assembly, have a peek inside, and then replace it all again like nothing ever happened. All right. Sounds like you got a plan. I'll hang around and keep an eye on that guy with the cow. Andy. Shit, I, th I thought that was Danny. Whatever. Can I help you boys find something? <laughs> Kenny thought he heard a noise. He's a little jumpy, huh? Well, we're all sure glad his wife is here. She's a lifesaver. You, you got no idea. Hey, uh, do me a favor. D don't fuck around with this door, okay? Just, you know, mama gets nervous. Andrew, I need your help again. No problem. Right away, Doc. Hey, guys, seriously, don't fuck around with that. Come on, enough already. Hmm. Hey there, Andy. Yeah. Danny mentioned he needed something. Did he say what? Shit, I, I can't remember now. Sorry. <sighs> all right, all right. Be right back, Doc. So, jetzt mal schnell die Tür aufmachen und mal gucken, was da ist. Okay, let's do this. False alarm, I'm back. Okay, das ist so schnell, äh, so einfach geht das nicht. Ich frag mal Kenny, was der dazu zu sagen hat. I tried distracting Andy, but he keeps coming back. There's got to be something out there you can mess with to keep him busy for a while. Yeah, what about those generators? So, how does a woman like yourself run this whole place? Oh, I manage just fine. Plus, I have my boys to help out. I couldn't do it without them. So, mach ich einfach mal den Generator ein bisschen kaputt. 
Aber erstmal ganz kurz gucken, da hinten ist so eine Werkzeugkiste. Hol ich mir erstmal einen Schraubenzieher. Ach, das Ding hat. Das tut es auch. So, jetzt mal gucken. Ups, war keine Absicht. Damn, this thing is the worst piece of shit. Something's always tripping the breaker. Okay, so einfach wird's nicht gehen. Man muss wahrscheinlich erst einmal irgendwas, äh Irgendwas Where lösen Andy oder so. Ich glaube, Andy weiß, wie man das fixen kann, wenn etwas falsch geht. Aber wir uns über das Mal schauen, was haben wir denn hier so. Außer den Ein- und Ausschalter. Ich komme da also so schnell nicht ran. Ich muss erst noch was suchen, womit ich das blockieren kann oder so. Wird sie ja irgendwas finden. Ja. Ah, mal schauen. Ich denke mal nicht, dass ich mit Benzinkanistern oder Steckdosen irgendwas erreichen werde. Also gehe ich mal weiter. Wer, wer weiß, vielleicht finde ich ja irgendwas. Hallo. Glad I got to use her today. My girl here. You really like that girl. What's not to like? Just kind of creepy, that's all. Times like these, a 243 will keep you warmer at night than any lady I ever know. Mm -hmm. You guys are pretty out in the sticks here. Hard to find. You get many visitors? Not anymore. Bandits, of course. Used to get these school kids on tours back before the dead time. How do you run this place with just one cow? Used to have more. They get hungry too. Or sick. Got your doctor friend here now, though. You guys must trade for a lot of fuel to keep the generators running, right? People get hungry, and a few loaves of bread fetch a high price. Y'all are luckier on this side of the deal now. I'm gonna go wait for supper then. It'll be a good one. Ich vertraue dir immer noch nicht so ganz. All fixed. That should make everyone happy. Aber irgendwie nur, weil der so nervös geworden ist wegen der Kamera. Ich würde ja extrem gerne rein, äh, wissen, was da jetzt drauf ist. We'll, uh, we'll finish talking later. You've been getting along with Larry. <laughs> he just a big old sweetheart, ain't he? Uh, don't know if I would have used those words exactly. Don't judge, honey. This world is bringing out the worst in people. But if you really look, you'll catch a glimpse of humanity every now and then. How's Mark doing in there? Best patient I ever had. Oh, my boys get so much as a scratch and start hollering. He could definitely teach them a thing or two about being tough. I'd still like to check on him. You're gonna have to trust me on this, Lee. I've helped stitch my share of wounds. I know what I'm talking about. <clears throat> so, what are y'all keeping the barn back there? Besides cows, I mean. Well, someone's getting a little curious, aren't they? I don't mean to pry. It's nothing interesting, I can promise you that much. Just some odds and ends. Takes a lot to run a farm, you know. 
we ran into some trouble out there. I was just glad you two weren't hurt. Those bandits just don't know when to quit. But my boys, they can hold their own. Your boy Danny is nuts. No, that's not a very nice thing to say, Lee. He seemed to enjoy this woman's death. I'm sure he didn't. He is sensitive and willing to do whatever it takes to protect this place. I think I'll go have a look around. Kind of peaceful out here, ain't it? Enjoy it while you can. You'll probably start hearing those monsters frying against the fence before too long. Ich brauche noch irgendwas, um das zu blockieren oder kaputt zu machen oder irgendwas auf jeden Fall. Mal gucken, vielleicht hat er was Neues. Nee. We'll nice Über die sagt irgendwie immer nur dasselbe. Das heißt, ähm, ich könnte mich noch da umsehen. Da hinten, wo, wo Larry und Lily sind. Eventuell haben die noch was zu sagen. Vielleicht finde ich hier aber noch was. Lots of hay. Uh, enough of these might work as adequate cover from arrows, if that becomes a problem. Looks like a feeding station for the cow. Dann gehe ich mal zu den anderen beiden. Mal ein kurzes Schwätzchen halten. What's going on, Lee? Did something happen? There may be something going on with that barn. I'm telling you, Lee. The longer we stay here, the more trouble we're getting ourselves into. And what exactly do you think I'm supposed to do about it? If you want to go in there and start rooting through other people's shit, then get to it. But if it's up to me, we should just take our food and go. What were you and Kenny arguing about when I came back from the camp? He's losing it, Lee. He comes over and starts talking about searching the barn and that these people are hiding something. But you told him to mind his own goddamn business, right? We are guests here and we don't need to be overstaying our welcome more than we already are. The way I see it, we just need to skip the dinner and get our food to go. But I'm starting to think your friend over there has another agenda. Hmm. I'm gonna go check things out. Watch yourself, Lee. So, Larry, it uh, looks like you're getting along with Brenda pretty well. You know, for a nice change of pace, how about you try and mind in your own fucking business? Ja, ich denke mal, das wäre sehr deutlich. Naja, das Einzige, was ich mal versuchen könnte, wäre mal den Generator auszuschalten. Während es offen ist, vielleicht kann man ja noch kurz was machen, bevor der rauskommt. Das habe ich nämlich jetzt noch nicht versucht. Wenn ich das Ding immer ausmache und der sieht, dass ich daran rumgefummelt habe, wird es vielleicht hässlich. So, dann einem schnell mal weg. Fucking Danny, where did he find this piece of shit? Oh, fucking thing through a belt. Damn it, dog. Ah, son of a fuck. Oh, this take forever. Perfekt. Jetzt mit dem Multitool komme ich auch wunderbar äh, in die Scheune da. Beziehungsweise in das hintere Tor. Mom, Dad, Dinner Time! It's Dinner Time!